Hello there. Good afternoon. Rain or showers today and then through the latter part of the week turning humid in the south again. But for the time being, temperatures well below what we've seen over the last few days as the rain clears down towards the southeast. A rash of showers across the north with the risk of thunder. But in between, some lovely sunshine and some sunshine to end the day across many areas. Temperatures typically the mid-teens to low 20s. So overnight tonight, some starry skies, particularly across central and eastern areas, Further showers in the west, a fresher feel to things with a stronger wind in the northwest. And tomorrow, more rain pushes in towards the north, brighter skies in the south. Bye bye. So, with the weather being so changeable over the next few days and quite a strong breeze at times, the weed pollen count is likely to remain low, not only through today, but also tomorrow. And that really sets the scene as we head into the weekend. I'll see you later. Bye bye for now. The pollen report on Channel 5. Hello there, good afternoon. This weekend, rain at times, particularly across the central swathes of the UK, very warm in the south if you catch some sunshine. Through Friday afternoon, you can see where the rain is across the western side of the country. Low misty cloud here, brighter skies down towards the southeast if the cloud breaks up. And here, temperatures 22 degrees Celsius, 17 or 18 under that cloud band. And the winds pick up further strength through the latter part of the day, particularly across the north and west of Scotland. Gusty winds here. We continue to see a legacy of rain first thing tomorrow morning with that rain just clipping the far south of Scotland, Northern Ireland and northwest England. Bright skies in the north and south. Bye-bye. So conditions remain changeable over the next few days, but there will be some sunshine in the forecast as well. So despite the fact pollen levels are likely below, that's weed pollen, fungal spores could actually rise to moderate locally if you do catch that sunshine. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Hello there, good afternoon. Over the next few days, a fair amount of cloud, the odd drizzly shower, but feeling warm and humid, and weather cloud breaks up, feeling very warm indeed. Not a lot of weather going on, the, the movement of the weather is very benign, very slow, but there will be some breaks in the clouds, favoured spots, perhaps western Scotland seeing some quite strong sunshine here, 18 or 19 will be your high in the south, 26 if you do catch some brighter skies. And overnight tonight with the canopy of clouds, and again a bit drizzly in places, temperatures dipping no lower than around 17 or 18 in the south, 14 or 15 across the central lowlands of Scotland. And pretty much a repeat performance tomorrow. Bye-bye. So weather conditions are likely to remain fairly quiet over the next few days with a light breeze. Despite that, weed pollen count will remain low right across the country, not only through today, but also tomorrow. So that's good news if you do suffer from hay fever. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. The pollen report on your allergy nasal spray. Hello there, good afternoon. Turning a lot fresher over the next few days as the weather front slowly moves its way southeastwards, but it will take its time. Currently across northern England and Wales, a little rain here to the south, bright with some sunshine, warm in the north. We can see here brighter skies, a few showers, but feeling a lot cooler as temperatures rise around 16 to 18 Celsius. We could see a 27 in the southeast help with some sunshine. Now overnight tonight, this weather front gradually clears down towards East Anglia in the southeast. In its way, clearer skies. Another weather front then pushes in across the northwest of Scotland and Northern Ireland, leading into a bit of a wetter day tomorrow with some showers to follow, still rather cloudy in the southeast. Enjoy every... So weather conditions remain fairly settled for the next 24 hours, but then turn fresher through Thursday into Friday. So let's have a look at the pollen count through the next few days, remaining low wherever you are, which is great news if you have suffered from hay fever over the past few months. Bye-bye. The pollen room. Hello there, good afternoon. Rain will sink southwards over the next 24 hours. Cloudy today, but turning brighter tomorrow. You can see where the cloud is, a little bit of patchy drizzle where the cloud is thick enough. This is the weather front bringing rain to the western side of Scotland, eventually Northern Ireland, as the wind picks up some strength. In the south, temperatures typically 18 to 21 degrees Celsius, further north than mid-teens. Overnight tonight, this rain gradually sinks down towards border regions. Eastern Scotland clears Northern Ireland, moves in across northern counties of England. Cloudy in the south and rather muggy, turning brighter here tomorrow. Sunshine and showers in the north. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Enjoy. So conditions remain fairly quiet over the next 12 hours, particularly across more central and southern areas of the country. And the wheat pollen count is likely to rise to moderate across these parts through Wednesday as this cold front sinks its way southwards, hanging on to moderate counts in the southeast. Bye bye for now. The breeze. It's a rare warning, but it goes out from Monday to Friday. Temperatures by day soaring well above 30 degrees Celsius. By night, 
dipping no lower than around 17, 18 Celsius. So this is an oppressive kind of heat. To put those temperatures in needle spray. Hello there, good evening. The heat will continue to build across the east and southeast through this week. There is a heat warning in force for these parts and a muggy night to come here tonight. Elsewhere, this weather front bringing with it a little rain to southern Scotland and northern England. Fresher conditions towards the northwest, but it will be a fine start to the day here. This cloud will straddle northern England as well as Wales and the west country with a little rain as we head through tomorrow. A few showers for Scotland and Northern Ireland, still very hot in the south, perhaps a degree lower than today, even so, coming in around 26 to 30 degrees Celsius. And that's how we see the end of the week. Bye-bye. Some good news if you do suffer from hay fever. The grass pollen season is coming to an end now, so north to south, east to west, pollen counts are likely to be low across the country. In fact, that sets the scene for the middle and also the end of the week. I'll see you later. Bye-bye for now. The Hello there, good evening. Rain or showers never too far away over the next few days, away from the south and southeast. But even here, with some rain, it will turn fresher as we head through Thursday into Friday. More about that in a moment. For the time being, quite muggy in the south, breezy across the north and west with a few showers across the northwest of Scotland. The rain returns across northwest England, southwest Scotland, as well as Northern Ireland. So a damp start to the day here. Through the day, always more clouds across these parts. Brighter skies towards the southeast, helping temperatures up towards the mid 20s. Elsewhere, around the low 20s again, with quite a brisk wind coming through during the afternoon. And then the rain eventually arrives across Wales and much of northern England, creeping into the far north Midlands. Elsewhere, some showers to come, and temperatures here only 14 to 16 degrees Celsius. It's rain or showers for many areas on Thursday. In between, some brighter weather will eventually appear, and temperatures look at this about average for this time of year. So up to around 20, 21 in the southeast, the mid-teens elsewhere. Pressure for many through Thursday into Friday, quite breezy in the northwest. The heat returns to the south on Saturday. Bye bye. So the weather remains fairly changeable over the next few days, breezy as well. And that's good news if you suffer from weed pollen. It's likely to be low right across the country. In fact, that sets the scene as we head through Wednesday into Thursday. In fact, Friday as well. Unsettled with pressure with lower levels of pollen. The pollen report. Hello there, good evening. The weather remains changeable into the weekend, but it will turn a lot more muggy by night. For the time being, rain clears towards the southeast. Starry skies for many areas, but those showers continue across Scotland, Northern Ireland, northwest England with the odd rumble of thunder. Fresh start tomorrow morning, bright across England and Wales before thickening cloud brings outbreaks of rain. So a wet end to the day for Northern Ireland, Scotland, northwest England, as well as west Wales. After a bright start across more southern and eastern areas, it will turn cloudy here. Temperatures 22, the mid-teens further north, particularly with that fresh breeze. And here's your outlook into the weekend. More rain on the cards. Bye-bye. Enjoy the... So the pollen levels are affected by weather conditions, and the weather will remain changeable over the next few days. And that's good news if you do suffer from weed pollen, which is in season now. Low counts through Friday... And that really sets the scene for the weekend. Low levels right across the UK. Bye-bye. The spray. Hello there, good evening. Some rain in the forecast this weekend, but turning warmer and more humid away from the far north of Scotland. Overnight tonight, the rain clears much of Scotland. Still a very strong wind here, and that will continue into tomorrow. And the legacy of the cloud continues across Northern Ireland, southern Scotland, northwest England. So it's a damp weather first thing tomorrow morning. Cloudy across England and Wales, but the cloud will break at times away from windward coasts. We continue to see a blustery day across Scotland, but also with some sunshine. Temperature then typically in any brighter spells, 23 Celsius, further north the mid-teens. And the outlook for Sunday, more rain at first. So the weather remains changeable as we head into the weekend. Some sunshine around. And despite the fact weed pollen will be low across the country, we could see moderate levels of fungal spore where you do catch some sunshine through Saturday into Sunday. I'll see you later. Have a lovely weekend. Hello there. Good evening. A succession of weather fronts will bring fresher air and a cool breeze from the northwest over the next 24 hours or so. The first weather run clears off the scene very slowly tonight, still muggy in the southeast, 
cooler elsewhere and you can see the second weather front moving in with some outbreaks of rain for Scotland and Northern Ireland. It will rattle down towards Northern England as we head through the afternoon. Brighter skies in between, but a lot of showers coming in across Scotland and Northern Ireland through Thursday afternoon. Here, temperatures 14, 15 degrees Celsius, 23 if you're lucky in the southeast. That's the picture on Thursday. Through into the weekend, some chilly nights, some showers, rain on Sunday. Ensure nothing. So there's a real transition in our weather over the next few days, turning fresher with showers and some sunshine. And we come into the end of the pollen season as well, which is great news if you have been sneezing a lot through the summer months. Low counts of pollen likely through Thursday and also into Friday. Bye-bye. Good evening. Now, despite a weather front pushing southeastwards over the next 12 hours, we're going to see some quieter conditions and also some sunshine. For the time being, you see this rain moving in across border regions. Aberdeenshire, Northern England, clearing Northern Ireland. Muggy in the south with temperatures 16 Celsius and a bit wet here first thing. This weather front here tends to ease. The rain dries up as it clears towards the southeast. In its way, brighter skies. A few showers across the northwestern side of Scotland, Northern Ireland. Temperatures 16 Celsius, 21 in the south once the sun comes out later. And here's your outlook over the next few days into the weekend. Bye-bye. Hello there. Now, today there have been moderate counts of weed pollen across England and Wales. Come tomorrow, once this weather front clears down towards the southeast, it will just linger across more southern and eastern areas of England. In fact, that resets the scene for the next few days. Low counts for many areas, moderate in the south. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hello there, good evening. The warmth returns this evening across many parts, but there will be cloud and rain in the north and west. Overnight tonight, starry skies, not as cold as last night, and a few mist and fog patches. This weather front here brings rain to western parts of Scotland, Northern Ireland, and the western fringes of Wales. So damp conditions here first thing. And the rain across the northeast of Scotland should brighten up here. And you see where the sunshine is, anywhere from Pennines eastwards central southern England. Feeling warm here, temperatures 23 degrees Celsius, and in shelter across the eastern side of Scotland and Northern Ireland, 18 or 19. And here's your outlook for Sunday. Bye-bye.